Welcome back ladies and gentlemen to Fallout 4, my name's Camel and this video will be a guide in which I will show you how to acquire the Hot Rodder magazine that unlocks the Hot Rod Flame Job custom paint job for your power armor. Say that 10 times. To acquire this volume of the Hot Rodder magazine, we need to first come to the robotics disposal ground in the zone Lexington and Northwest Commonwealth. Instead of Diamond City, I will be using Vault 111 as a reference point because it's so damn close. And as we can see on the Pip-Boy map, the robotics disposal ground is east northeast of Vault 111. I'm going to be approaching this from the direction of Vault 111, so we will be coming through the hole in this fence to the middle of the disposal ground and then south into this building. So let's do that in real time. We need to run up through this hole in the fence between this gap, jump over the car next to the barrels, under the lamp, and up towards this building. Once here, all we need to do is walk through the door, and then on the table next to the terminal is the magazine in question. Here it is up close, and as we can see, Hot Rudder Magazine flame job. Sounds like a Friday night with a redhead. And when we pick it up, Hot Rudder, you've collected an issue of Hot Rudder. Permanently unlock a new custom paint job for your power armor. And it is made quite apparent which custom paint job this is. So to apply our new custom paint job to our power armor, first we must park our power armor at a power armor station. All this requires us to do is hop out of our power armor near a power armor station like I've done here on screen. Once this is done, walk up to the power armor station and click to craft. Once here, all we need to do is select the piece of power armor, go to the second mod that says no material mod, and then select the hot rod flames paint. Click back twice, select the next piece, and rinse and repeat. It should also be noted that if all pieces of your power armor set are painted with the hot rod flames paint job, your agility will be increased by one point. And once this is complete, we now have our full set of hot rod flames paint power armor and our bonus point of agility. And here we go, check this stuff out. This flames paint paint job is really cool. I like that it has such bold black and red contrasting. It makes your character look kind of evil. It should be noted that the Hot Rod Flames paint job can be applied to all series of power armor, excluding the Raider power armor, as it cannot be painted at all. Not only will you have the coolest power armor in Boston, you will also have the hottest power armor. Word of this crazy paint job will spread like wildfire, and in no time at all, you will be flamous across all of Boston. And there you have it, that does conclude the guide on how to acquire the Hot Rodder magazine that unlocks the Hot Rod Flames custom paint job for your power armor. I've been Camel, I would like to thank you very much for watching, I do hope that this video helped you to some degree in acquiring the Hot Rod Flames custom paint job for your power armor. If you would like to see other Fallout 4 guides, please feel free to click on the playlist button on screen. This of course will take you to my Fallout 4 guides playlist where you can select the videos you want to watch at will. The link will also be in the description, and also in the description it will be frequently updated with links to new Fallout 4 guides that I put up, so if you want to check for guides there as well, please feel free to do so. Once again, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you very shortly in the next video. I'll see you there.